It's World War II Wendell, we're at Syston in Leicestershire and it's some more magnet fishing. Today we've got Blake, aka Blakeback Mountain, myself James, me Ian, Uncle Ian's with us. Let the games begin. Let's have a throw. Blake's already in, he's had the first throw because he's greedy. Ian's off. We're at a beautiful setting today, Syston, Leicestershire. This bridge was built 1790. Granite built, it's listed, which means in England it's protected. 1790 then, King George III was the king. For American viewers, George Washington, your first president. When this bridge was built, what's he got? Nothing on the first shot. Nothing for Ian. Blake, you got anything yet? This is Blake's first caught magnet fishing, so we're hoping he don't fall in. No. no. Granite built bridge, brick fascias, I'd say rubble infill. We're on the River Reek. Lovely setting, but we're right near to a very busy road, so you might get a bit of road noise, as well as my noise. Has it got anything yet? What's that? What's that? What's that? Yeah. A little bit of bum rubbish. Yeah. Bum rubbish. I think we need super magnet on the job. Yeah, I think we do. So I'm going to glove up. We'll get super magnet out and see if we can fish anything out with that. Ian today is sporting his uh, brand new hat that he's purchased. He oh, thought yeah. he'd got one nil up on me. Yeah. Then we've turned up today. <laughs> I've got myself one off eBay. <laughs> gutted. He's gutted. I am. Absolutely. Go on, one more throw each then, you boys. It's a big throw. He's the king of the big throws, Ian. Of course, he's getting ready for the European Magnet Fishing Championships that take place in three weeks' time. I know there's entrants from Latvia, Scotland, there's a Spanish fella coming over. Check our channel, we'll be doing footage of that. I think Ian's got himself a tree. I was just trying to move it out of the way for Super Magnet. Oh, that's okay then. Someone's on that. No, that's not, it's a tree. You got anything yet, Blake? In he goes. In he goes. Hat as well. Of course, they call Ian the brown hat around this way because he used to wear a brown hat. Oh, you. They are. World War II Wendell cleaning the waterways. Yeah. World War II Wendell. James thinks he's uh, on something quite, quite big here. Summit, so I've told them to clean into video and now it's feeling a little bit lighter than it did when I said it. Good deal. It's good deal too. Might be summit, might be a branch. Actually it is still got summit on it. What are we saying then kids? What are you saying, Michael? Uh, like some sort of frame. Rubbish or dead body. Yeah. There's definitely summit on it. Summit pig. Oh he has. <gasps> okay. Oh there you are. Piece of scaffolding. Oh. Never mind. Yeah, uh, we're letting Blake have a, a quick chuck in on his first go round here. We're about to move. We are not getting much on that side, so. Uh, Snags them at the moment, they're So, James is. Uh, something on a snag. Hey, oh. What the hell is Have that? Head. Bloody hell. What's that? Well, it's obviously a knife, isn't it? Yeah. Fuck you. Look how easy you use in the army. Yeah. It's not army. No, it's not army, that. It's got, uh, what's on the head? What's that? It's some sort of reptile. That's metal, isn't it? It's that top metal. Is it? Well, it's not. Yeah. Good that now. is. The best thing I think I've ever found. There's something missing out of that bit, look. Yeah. Is there? Check I wonder if that could be like a flip thing. Is that? Could have been a chain where you have another knife in it. That? I wonder if it were another bit of like that. You know what I mean? It's lost yeah. Lost that side of it. It's obviously been in there a long time, isn't it? It has. Look at that. Oh, it says something on it. Stainless. 
So I tell you, I don't think it's. I don't know, it's hard to tell it's, if it's, it's really. It's a because it's got the groove in there as well. It's hard to like tell if it's knot. really, really old or if it's. I mean, it ain't no more than 100 year old, that's for sure. But well, we've well. come to this bit around here, you can see the kids kids have been swinging here. You can see the under area. And there's little campfires here. But that could have been a kid playing with that 40, 50 year ago, couldn't it? Right. World War II, Wendell. Like and subscribe. We've got a knife. Oh, that's not a knife. This is a knife. Find of the day. Well worth coming. So far. Unbelievable, Jeff. Let's carry on the magnet fishing. So after the find of me, James, with the knife, Uncle Ian's having a throw with Super Magnet now, seeing if he can find anything good. We're still amazed by that uh, little, well, it's a dagger, isn't it? Dagger knife, hunting knife, something like that. We didn't think we'd find anything like that around here. We thought it would be uh, pennies and things like that. Anything coming up? What's he got? Oh, he has. Yeah, what you got? What is that? <coughs> That's just the bottom of a can, that is. The rest of it rots away. Is it anything or is it? Uh, Should we throw this back in? That looks like rubbish. Have another quick throw, Wendell. No, because we'll pick it up again. Just leave it on the side. We'll have the uh, clean-up crew sort it out. Callum's obviously been here before. As you can see, there's his underpants. <laughs> Where's that sock? There's a sock down there as well. Meanwhile, Uncle Ian's still uh, persevering. That feels like he's on some. I can see it straining. It's April 2017. Does it feel heavy, Wendell? It's bubbling, so I bet you've either got a branch or you've got summit on it, haven't you? Oh, it's something big. Something big. Is that picking up? It's pole. There's summit on the end, though, isn't there? It looks thick down this end. Is that just mud? Or is, that... is that one, yeah. Is it part of that? Yeah. No, that's just where bits are stuck to it, isn't it? It ain't like fishing related, is it? It's too, too heavy. He's got the magnet stuck in it, but he don't say it. It just looks thick, this end, doesn't it? Just get that, get that quick brush there with your glove. See if the... reckon there is? We'll clean it up, if it is anything, we'll uh, film it again. If it's not, we won't bother. Mm. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. It is weird, isn't it? Like a double-ended pole, isn't it, of some sort? It's so metal as well. No camping, is it? No, it's no, too, too heavy. Too heavy, is it? Heavy? Just pull, Blake, then. You pull. Meanwhile, back on James's finds pile. <laughs> Godzilla! Hey look, Ian, if I do this, it's a lot less monster. <laughs> Ian's having a go with Super Magnet because he's confident he's found something down there. Oh, don't get stuck again. Look at this plank. It's moving, he says. And it's heavy, it's big. He couldn't bring it in with a standard magnet, so he's gone in with a big boy. Is it still on it? He thinks it's come off. Let's have a look. Oh no! Oh no! Oh, it's a big bit of pipe. It's either a big bit of pipe. Got loads of pipes. Yeah, another bit. We've fished out loads of pipe the other side, that's why we've come in here. Well, I think that's going to be it for magnet fishing today. Ian's found lots of bits of pipe. They're pipe. Obviously, the highlight of the day, without any shadow of a doubt. Oh, look at Ian now. Oh, that's going to stink. That is going to smell. Definitely that. 
That has got to be the best thing I think I've ever found magnet fishing. And bear in mind, I'm one of the world's top two magnet fishermen. Look at that. Like and subscribe. Like and subscribe. Check out the other videos, plenty of magnet fishing. We're going to keep coming. Keep finding good things, trying out different bridges. Last throw of the day then for the uh, Ian Wendell. He's having a last throw. Nothing. So that concludes the magnet fishing. Yes. Another successful day. Legends of the game. What about? Keeping history alive. Stay awesome.